Hi everyone, uh, this is Juliana and I am back here with Zach as I sit in the driver's seat uh, with Undertale. And I'm Zach and I'm the backseat, which has apparently already been introduced for me. <laughs> well, I just said your name. Sounds good. Well, whatever. Do we want to do it again? No, it's fine. Fine. Uh, we just left off. We just got to Toriel's house. Yes. So, so now we are going to go inside Toriel's house. Yes. Hopefully I can remember all the, uh, the lovely... Z and X. Z and X. Yeah, Z and X. Do you uh, smell that? Surprise! It's it is a butterscotch cinnamon pie. Awesome! I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here. So I will hold off on snail pie for tonight. Here, I have another surprise for you. This is it. A room of your own. I hope you like it. Oh. Is something burning? Um, uh, make yourself at home. Snail pie it is. S uh, C and X, right? Z and X. Yes. Let's try to splow. Okay, so... They don't interest you at all. Oh. photo frame. It's really dusty. A box of kids' shoes and a disparity of sizes. Sleepy Betty time. Yep. Aww. You found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie. Yes. I might have been all tuckered out. I assume. Yes. What does that say? That's C to just interact or read, right? Z to interact or read, yeah. Room under renovations. Okay. It's you! Yay! Inside the drawer, flower seeds and some broken crayons. That was rude, but... Say what? Gonna do it anyway. Just a regular old bucket of, of snails. snails. It's Toriel's diary. Read the circle passage. No. I'm already breaking. It's an encyclopedia of subterranean plants you open to the middle. Typha. A group of wetland flowering plants with brown oblong seed pods. Hmm. Known more commonly as water, water sausages. sausages. <laughs> you peek inside. Scandalous. It's Toriel's sock drawer. Ah, the cactus. Truly the most sundry of plants. Done my snoop snoops. Oh! It is a water sausage. I think if you looked at it before, you would have been like, huh, weird plant. Yep. <laughs> Probably. I kind of want to check out the seeds I grabbed. You didn't grab seeds. Oh. I don't think so. Press C. That's your inventory. Yeah, no. Err. Item. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no. How do I get out? Shift. Right. Shift. I want to explore more. Because that's the bad human I am. Inside is an old calendar from the beginning of 2000X. Hmm. 
These books are worn. They must have been read many times. Alright, nope. No? Nope. Why not? What? Why not? <sighs> Color change indicates that is not somewhere I should go without being told right now. Not necessarily. I did my snoop snoop. There's more snoop snoop to do. There is more snoop snoop, which is why I'm going... Okay. There's much more snoop snoops to snoops. It's a history book. Here's a random page. Trapped behind the barrier and fearful of further human attacks, we retreated. Far, far into the earth we walked until we reached the cavern's end. This, is where this was our new home, which we named Home. As great as our king is, he's pretty lousy at names. The ends of the tools have been filed down to make them safer. A.K.A. less dangerous. Or, you know, more pointless. Then I'm chiss. But you know how glad I am to have someone here. There are so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I have always wanted to be a teacher. Not at all. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. <laughs> Still, I am glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? I can't go home, can I? Well, you never know if you don't ask. What? Th this, is, this is your home now. Um, would you like to hear about this book I'm reading? It's called 72 Uses for Snails. How about it? You gotta be homesick. I'm about to know the answer. You can't leave. The way you fell is... Well, you don't know if you don't have time. Well, how about an exciting snail fact? Did you know that snails talk really slowly? Just kidding. Snails don't talk. Interesting. <laughs> I have to do something. Stay here. size of the pie intimidates you too much for you to eat it. Hmm. Inside the cupboard are cookie cutters for gingerbread monsters. <laughs> There's some white fur stuck in the drain. So surprised. Oh, right. For some reason, there is a brand named Chocolate Bar in the fridge. She went. I think if you press C, that's X. Eh. She went downstairs. Yep. You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I am going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now be a good child and go upstairs. Yeah, not a good child. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. 
have seen it again and again. They come. They leave. They die. You naive child. If you leave the ruins, they, Asgore, will kill you. I am only protecting you. Do you understand? Go to your room. Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. You want to leave so badly? Hm. You are just like the others. There is only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Talking's not doing anything. Remember earlier? There you go. She's starting to back down, and she's starting to nod. Uh-huh. What are you proving this way? You don't have to try um. and get hit. I want you to notice that. Yeah. Yeah, she's avoiding you now. Yep. Please, go upstairs, now. The 
promise I will take good care of you here. We do not have much, but... We can have a good life here. Why are you making this so difficult? I have my answer for that. Which Beyond is, the game. What's that? No matter how much you make another place home, unless it's your choice, it's never really home. Yeah, uh, that's actually a really good insight. I never thought about it that way. At least not the context of this game. Yeah, I mean, so, I mean, I get it. Like, you you at least have to try to get home first before you accept that home this other not, place yeah. could be home. Mm -hmm. Please, go upstairs. She is sad. What? Pathetic, is it not? I cannot even save a single child. Can I hug her? <laughs> It's not in the list. It's not on the list. No, I understand. You would just be unhappy trapped down here. The ruins are very small once you get used to them. It would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. For you, my child, I will put them aside. If you truly wish to leave the ruins, I will not stop you. However, when you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. See, hug. Yep. Goodbye, my child. Bye, goat mom. I want to go back and read the diary, but I won't. I'll be good. <laughs> I think it's a little past that now. Yeah. Changing the color purples. Ever so slightly. Huh. Fucking. Clever. Very clever. You think you're really smart, don't you? In this world, it's kill or be killed. So you were able to play by your own rules. You spared the life of a single person. <laughs> I bet you feel really great. You didn't kill anybody this time. But what will you do if you meet a relentless killer? You'll die, and you'll die, and you'll die. Until you tire of trying. What will you do then? Will you kill out of frustration? Or will you give up entirely on this world? And let me inherit the power to control it. I am the prince of this world's future. Don't worry, my little monarch. My plan isn't regicide. This is so much more interesting. <laughs> well then. Pet you too. <laughs> Pretty much.
Undertale. Right. Yeah, so uh, I think we've gotten to a nice spot where uh, we can take a pause. Hopefully there's a save point here soon. Yeah. So. There should be. Do anything in that bush? There's a camera! And the bushes. shocked face okay so all right please please no wolves I don't need wolves in my life right now it's a tough looking branch too heavy to pick up that's not good that is scaring me ah uh, I could walk faster, I'd walk faster, but I can't walk faster. Shit. Human. Yeah. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. How do I do that? <laughs> the old whoopee cushion of the head trick. It's always funny. Anyways, you're a human, right? That's hilarious. I'm Sans. Sans the skeleton. God damn it. Do you get it? Uh-huh. Do you get the joke? Yeah. For those of you who don't know, Sans is without. Sans, without this. No, 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 no. It's even more petty than that. Look at the font. Well, yes, but. It's Comic Sans. I'm actually supposed to be on Watch for Humans right now. But, you know. I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now, my brother, Papyrus. He's a human hunting fanatic. <laughs> hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars too wide to stop anyone. Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. Boop. What's up, bro? You know what's up, brother. It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Stare at this lamp. It's really cool. You wanna look? No, I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Then I, the great papyrus. As we'll get, cape waves. Yeah. We'll get all the things I utterly deserve. And you know the font in this character? Respect. Recognition. Papyrus. I will finally be able to join the royal guard. People will ask to be my friend. I will bathe in the shower of kisses every morning. Huh. Maybe this lamp will help you. Sans, no! You are not helping, you lazy bones. <laughs> <laughs> what? All you do is sit and boondoggle. You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. You've got a ton of work done today. A skeleton. Oh god. <laughs> That's the worst. Sans! Come on. 
You're smiling. I am and I hate it. <laughs> Why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get some recognition? Wow. Sounds like you're really working yourself. Down to the bone. Yeah. I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okay, you can come out now. You ought to get going. You might come back. And if he does, you'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. I think it's just a, just rocks. Fine. Some sort of checkpoint or sentry station. There are bottles of ketchup, mustard, and relish sitting inside. Same thing. Got that. My bad. My bad. Moving on. Actually, hey, hate to bother you, but can you do me a favor? Oh, I was thinking, my brother's kind of been down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous. Even if he tries, even if he tries to be. Thanks a million. I'll be up ahead. There's the same point. Yep. Maybe does that lamp still fizz you with determination? <laughs> of course it does. Save. There we go. Alright. Okay. So this one is definitely one of our longer ones. Yes, um, definitely longer ones. I kind of apologize for that, but... Anyway. Uh, Alright. Thank you so much for making it through this. Yeah, thank you guys for watching. Uh, and it's very much appreciated. Yes. And if you would like to like, comment, or subscribe. Please do. Yes. So we'll see you in the next video. Yes, thank you guys for watching. We'll catch you guys in the next one. All right. Bye. Doodle doodle. <laughs>